How are you doing, Mr. Angry? How are you? I'm glad to, to come. put you some questions. With pleasure. Mind. Please take a seat. I'll try to answer you. Quite a lot of people here in Norway, they believe that the English and Americans are coming to save Norway from population if Germany should lose the war. What is your opinion about that? Well, you know, I'm very sorry for those people because they're completely crazy. They take their desires to be a reality. As a matter of fact, I have statistics here in front of me. If the Germans were defeated by the Russians, the Russians will have an army of over 1,000 divisions of well-armed but starving troops who would invade Europe and, incidentally, Norway. They would take and pillage everything and against these Russian troops, according to their own statistics, not mine, the Anglo-Americans could perhaps one day possibly oppose 250 divisions. And you know there's this, which is much more important. These eventual 250 divisions, the rescuers, they've been told for three years that Mr. Stalin is a kind old man, you know, a nice kind old man. It's normal. They'd leave nowhere to have faith. And King Hakon and his friends would find themselves betrayed in exactly the same way. That the Finns have been betrayed, that the Poles have been betrayed, and that anybody else who puts his faith in London or Washington will eventually be betrayed. And those that instead of helping civilization waited for London to save them, well, you know they'll be dead for them and their wives and their children. That's the truth. Well, that's all the way well, Mr. Emery. But uh, how is it that you are in Germany when your own country is at war with Germany and many other European countries? Quite a lot of people they perhaps think that you're a traitor. Well, you know, only history will be able to judge that. My view is that it is these people, Churchill, Roosevelt and his friends, who are the real traitors. Traitors to England, traitors to our empire, to our ancestors, and worse than that, traitors to Europe, to Christianity and civilization.